thank you so much. I always dreamed about what it would be like to maybe win one of these someday, but I never actually thought that would happen. Uh, I sing country music, so thank you so much for giving me a chance to win a VMA award. I... Yo, Taylor, I, I'm really happy for you. I'm gonna let you finish. But Beyonce had one of the best videos of all time. One of the best videos of all time. What's up, guys? Um, it's about 9.30 a.m. I got to work early today. Today is Saturday the 24th, which means it's Yeezy Day. They're restocking the zebras today, so I had to head out early or else I wouldn't have time to get in the lines and uh, just be set up and prepared. Uh, me and my buddy has got some bots running this morning, so I'm going to see if that comes through for me, but I'm mainly relying on myself to try to get a uh, square pair manually. So we're going to head in here and uh, get everything set up and then hopefully, I got my fingers crossed, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully I score. I do got on the Kanye Wings Boost God shirt for good luck. Good luck's important. Uh, so we're going to see if we can get this done. guys as you can see we're all set up I got this line queued up this line queued up this line queued up and I'm waiting on Adidas and then I also have them all queued on the iPad as well so we're gonna see how this goes wish me luck I will report back once it's all said and done and we'll see where we stand two hours later so I've got good news and I've got bad news. Uh, the bad news is the easy drop, there was a lot of pairs, but it just seemed to not be working out for me. The bot was successful, it carded multiple pairs for me, but it would not go through the checkout process, I don't know why. Adidas never let me in. Um, until the very end when they were sold out. East Bay had stock, but it wasn't letting me cart. Champs had stock, but it wasn't letting me cart. It was looking like a big fat L today. Uh, my wife did hop on at home, and this is where the good news comes in. Adidas let her in, and I got my size. I got a pair of zebras. Finally, I missed them on the first release. I have the creams, I have the breads. I've got a pair on pretty much every release. Uh, that I've went after except for the first zebra release so I got my pair I'm stoked I also it looks like I get to leave work early and go to the cannabis cup so I'm stoked on that so it's panning out to be a great day and a good start to my weekend so I hope all of you guys that were going after the zebras today copped and I cannot wait until they hit the mailbox and we can take a look at them on the vlog so yes, I am stoked, stay tuned, zebras are coming soon.
No, just your neighborhood homeless man picking his ass. Look, I found our friend again. Apparently I just missed it and there's a bum fight, but this guy's like over here playing with his junk. Dude's like super weird. Look at him. Good? Yep. Alright. Hi, my name is Mark. Uh, just got my brother-in-law here, my sister, my nephew, my niece. Uh, we're going to take the tour. Oh, my little brother's over there too, but he's gay, so he ain't going to be in the video very much. Um, my girlfriend's over there. As you can see right here, it's uh, Jade and Mark's place. You know, it's just our little key thing. It's pretty cool. Picked up at Target. Jade, how much was it? Like 15 Huh? You can get it at Target $20. All right, Target, I expect to get paid off this. Okay, this is the front door, obviously. This is in Ann Arbor, Michigan, uh, my favorite place in the world. Uh, it's got the best football team in the world. Um, so we're just going to take a tour around. This is our first time here. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, so we'll go right into here. This Make sure you be, turn on the lights because you need good lighting. Baby's lighting. nursery. There is no light in here. There's no oh, light okay. in the bedrooms. Um, Natural sunlight only. Just like our house. Oh. But we can turn that on. This will be the nursery eventually. Uh, the baby won't be here for another three months, so we haven't really set anything up. Um, this is the closet, obviously. And it's a pretty big closet for this uh, extra bedroom. Yeah. So, got an attic. I uh, haven't gone up there yet because I'm afraid of falling through the ceiling. <laughs> so, You're going to break now, the blind. Stop. People stay the night. They sleep there. Cause Looks like a shag bed. Oh! Could be, I guess, if people want to, but no couples have stayed. Ah. We're good. Solo only players. Oh my god. We got a closet here. You know, it's got this shark val vacuum uh, at our housewarming from my grandparents. Yeah. Uh, they hooked this up because we had this like yeah. 1990s one that sounded like it was going to explode. And then we got the main bathroom here. So it's pretty big. This is the main bathroom technically, but she uses it as her bathroom. As you can see, she's got all of her stuff right here. Uh, you come this way, and we got a shower and uh, toilet here. And then a nice little closet, extra space. So. Is that a butt plug? What? It's what a butt plug. Oh no, I was just kidding. Oh. Butt plug? <laughs> What is a butt plug? What? What's a butt plug? I don't know. You? Oh! I see what you did there. Alright, so we got the kitchen over here. So this is the renovated version. So we got the new countertops and updated appliances uh, that I like. It's like my favorite two spots right here because I love to eat. <laughs> so, I'm a fatty. Yeah, I'm on that diet life. My fridge don't look like that. Pop is poison, bro. So it is poison, but it's very good. Look at all that pop he's got. Yeah. A lot of the pop we got for the housewarming, but we didn't use a lot of it, surprisingly. So. 
Oh, for real though? These are fire. This is a shameless plug. I love these. I'm trying to get that Kellogg sponsorship. Heck yeah. Yeah. All right. Continuing on with the tourist there. kitchen. See, he really likes food. He even decorates his house with food. <laughs> This way, we got the dining room, living area, all at the same spot. This is our laundry room. Mm hmm. Laundry room. Here's the laundry room. What do you call me that? Oh, cool. Hmm? What do you call me that? Because it's true. What? Oh. Oh. We just got this TV stand put up. This is the. Well, I thought it came with that or something. I've ever done no. There was one when we did, when we did the tour. They had one similar that we really liked, but she said it didn't come with it. So we found one that was similar that we liked better, and we got it here. And it was literally the most ridiculous project I've ever done in my life. It took about a really? week to get it all built built and then put up on the wall right because it's a Fran It's made in France. So the way the holes are when you're mounting it aren't up to code with the United States. So it's like 15.2 inches apart instead of 16. So finding the studs, we had to make our own holes. It was ridiculous. But now that it's put together, it's really pretty and I'm happy with it. So then we got the balcony out there. Why don't you have the other drawer in there? Um, yeah, that was, I gotta figure that situation out. Um, I don't have, none of them are even hooked up right now. I just got them in there right now just to get it out of the way. So, the only thing I don't like is you can still see the cords on the bottom. So I think we're gonna get these like little square boxes, put blankets in them, and then line them up down there so you can't see the cords because it bugs me. And then we got our bedroom right here. It's a little messy. But... Uh, no light. Ow! Ow! It's like no lights. Another bathroom that is more short. Yeah. So this is our bedroom. And we got another bathroom in here, and we got a nice, pretty good-sized closet in here as well. So, just mainly her closet again. So, but one of my favorite things about this room, this is the new purple bed, by the way. So you should lay on it and feel it, because it's awesome. Oh! Yeah. Um, but I love this right here. Bam! What? Whoa! Pretty sweet, right? I love yeah. that, too. Green. Yellow, blue, wool. Yeah, and then we can set it up on a whole bunch of different colors or to do yeah. multiple colors. Yeah. So, and then we also have access to the balcony right here as well. Cool. So, That's and, cool. And then on the balcony, right on the side there, we have storage. So, it's like a just under 1,200 square foot apartment. So, we need some chairs out there. Yeah, we got. We already found the set we like too to go out there. So I just haven't bought it yet. Yeah. Ah. But one of my favorite things though is like a lot of apartments here just you know right up against stuff, and it doesn't look as good. But our view is just straight woods. It's really nice. How did you light that thing up with colors? Oh, you just start pressing all these buttons right here. But you got aim it at that white thing. There you go. All right, cool. You want to make your exit? So, thanks for uh, getting on this video, guys. You should definitely follow him, like, subscribe, whatever you got to do. Uh, share it because, you know, the more followers he gets, the better. Um, he's a great guy. does really good reviews. I watch all of his videos. Yeah. I'm not just, you know, tooting his horn. Yeah, um, well. But thanks for tagging along for the tour of my place here in Ann Arbor. Uh, we'll see you next time. All right, what's up, guys? We just got back home. Um, it's a little high. We just got back home from the outing, uh, so I went to Ann Arbor. We actually ended up meeting up with my brother-in-law. He recently got an apartment there. Um, so you guys would already be, have seen this part, but he did like a, he wanted to do like a, um, kind of like a walkthrough of his new place. Let me lower this a little bit. But uh, yeah, so that was all right. Got a little footage down there. Um, there was like the crazy bum that was walking around which you guys had seen already um, kind of digging in his ass and touching himself like a weirdo apparently they got into a fight when I was in um, 
Urban Outfitters. So I missed that. That would have been great to get on camera. But anyway, let's get to the to the most important part. I ran out there today basically just to not be in the house and then just get the kids out, let them burn a little energy. Uh, downtown's always a cool place to go. Um, I had to run to H&M though because of this diet. Um, a lot of my clothes are starting not to fit. A lot of the new jean shorts and stuff I bought are falling off. So I just went to go get some of their um, drawstring shorts. They got a really good price on them and I grab a couple shirts. So let's go ahead and check out what I got. And um, yeah, and then we'll wrap this thing up. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the footage so far. So, um, got a couple pairs of shorts. So one of them that I got is this like purple. Uh, these are like super comfortable and stretchy, got the nice drawstrings on them. So this is a little bit different, not a color I'd normally buy in shorts. I normally only buy um, black and gray, but I decided to go with these. Uh, they're pretty sweet. I'm excited about it. Um, the other pair that I got, of course, is a black pair. So same thing, just black, but super loungy, comfortable, good for summer. Match it up with a nice pair of kicks and throw on a t-shirt and you're out the door. Um, and then I believe I got one more pair. Let me find them here. So all this stuff's like super cheap. That's why I like it. I mean, $12 shorts, you can't go wrong. And it's pretty decent quality too. So I also got a blue pair. And then that was it. Every all, I wanted a gray pair, but everything was not in my size. I need smalls and there was like larges and XLs and that's it. I also did get a couple of these comfortable, and I do plan on going to the, start to go to the gym soon, so these are perfect, but I got like a gray, it's just a tank top, it's super soft, but these are like five bucks, dude, so why wouldn't I? And then I got a black one as well, and then of course, well actually they only had like gray and black and then white, and I don't really do white much, so I passed on that, but black one, super soft, stoked about it. And then I just grabbed a... Uh, just a t-shirt. I figured I'd pair this up with the purple shorts. So, it's pretty cool. It's got like that blurred out effect right there. I keep forgetting, but really soft. That's why I got them. And then, that was about it. That's pretty much all I got. I'm not really buying stuff like crazy right now. So, just stuff that I need and uh, essentials. But I did get a uh, Prime Knit Adidas hat. It's super comfortable. Uh, don't mind my beard, my hair. My mom was supposed to come over and cut it today, but um, with me wanting to go out for a little bit and stuff, it just didn't fit into the schedule right now. Actually, after this, I think I'm going to call her and see if she'll come over uh, cut my hair. Actually, I'm going to call her. Let's call her on here. Screw it. Why not? Damn, I left my mod downstairs, too, so I can't even vape. Yo, what's up? Oh, I'm making dinner. Oh. So you don't have a car? You can't come cut my hair? No, I don't. I don't have a car. Sean at uh, work, and then I gotta go get Bristol from Kathy as soon as he gets home. Oh, damn. Yeah, Alright. Well, t to yeah, I know. Well, tomorrow's like one of my earlier days. I'll be home at a decent time. You think you can swing by after work or something? Damn it, man. I'm about to just have Chrissy shave my head. Right. Yeah, I guess I could do something like that. Alright. Alright. Right on. Alright, cool. Prob probably. Yeah, I don't have a car. We only, I gotta go drop this Jeep off at his buddy's garage tomorrow before work. I gotta go to work. Alright. Alright, well, I'm gonna get off here then. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Alright, put it in there right now. Alright. Alright, bye. Bye. What? I don't think I ever showed you guys this before, but my phone case is a OG NMD. Pretty dope. Anyway. I'm going to get off here, uh, go eat some dinner, and then I'm going to start editing all this. So just remember, the beginning of this vlog is going to be um, yesterday's stuff. So I already explained it once, but yeah, basically yesterday was Zebra release. Uh, that vlog was supposed to be based on that. I was going to be at work all day. I was going to 
get footage and then I got an invite to the cannabis cup and I figured I couldn't bring my camera and then I get there and people did have cameras so I really wish I would have brought it because it would have been a super sweet vlog um, but bottom line is I didn't bring it so that didn't happen but anyways I'm getting out of here uh, like this video share it if you want to if you think it's cool whatever but uh, most importantly just like and like and subscribe man it really goes a long way I appreciate you guys and I'm out